And she's a woman who refused to be shamed by her gang rape in 2012 in Kolkata. Since then, she has refused to hide her identity and has become a prominent anti-rape activist. But the fight never ends, it seems. Suzanne Jordan filed an FIR today against a restaurant in Kolkata, saying that they discriminated against her because of her past. The restaurant denies it. Was the Park Street rape survivor denied access to a restaurant bar in Kolkata because she had been raped? Suzette has filed an FIR against Ginger, an establishment in South Kolkata's Kalighat area, saying they turned her away, citing her status as a rape survivor as the reason. The manager came out. He told me, he says, uh, sorry, I cannot allow you inside. I said, excuse me, why? He said, uh, you are the Park Street rape victim. The restaurant management has refuted the charge, saying that they did deny her access, but not for that reason. While the management has put forward their version of events, users on popular food website Zomato are outraged and are expressing their anger with low ratings. With one user saying, and I quote, if the management is okay with calling out a rape victim and denying her from entering, you should not be in business. Ginger is on my blacklist. The anger has already spread to Twitter, with hashtag boycott Ginger trending. At the Himal Sarkar tweeted, we can't stop every rape in this country, but we will not stand for a survivor being denied service. While the management has denied it, it's now up to the police to decide if this is a shocking case of victim shaming in Mamutaz, Bengal. NDTV Bureau Report.